you need to know what your practice is going to function like, you know, is, are there doctors that are going to come in behind you and pick up where you left off um, so that you really can have a day off? Um, because if you're not working somewhere full time, you're probably getting paid by either the hour or the day. And so if you spend the next two or three days doing paperwork and, and calling people, you're not getting paid for that. So as a locum, you don't really have that salary or that the kind of normal employment benefits that would make up for doing that extra work. You know, um, you're, it, I think it's easy to be taken advantage of if you don't set up good boundaries. Um, and so you have to be able to talk to your practice about that up front. And I wasn't always good at that at the beginning. Um, now I'm pretty good at it. Um, when I first started locuming, I would just say yes to everything and, and probably accepted some jobs that, you know, for lower amounts of money than I would have wanted and for, um, and put more time and effort into them than I, I think is probably appropriate. Um, and it's because I, I wasn't sure if it was going to work or how long I was going to be able to do this. And I didn't have another job. So I was a little, little panicked about paying bills and things like that. But now I've learned that if, some people say no, or, you know what, that deal doesn't work for us. And I can just say, okay, well, that's great. You know, good luck. And I'll, if I hear of anybody that's looking for a gig, I'll, I'll pass your name along. Um, it's okay. It's okay to say no to things and it's okay to pass on a job. Um, but I still feel a little bit weird when I say no. Um, there's a practice that I've been talking to right now that we're, we're having a difficult time agreeing on what the expectations are for everybody. You know, what they want me to do isn't really what I want to do. Um, and I've learned that you need that to be really clear right up front. Um, Cause the only time things have ever gone badly for me or when people thought I was going to be you know, showing up and on call, you know, seven days a week for three weeks and coming in after hours and on the weekends. And I mean, that's fine. If, they're going to pay me to do that. And if I'm, you know, expecting it, but um, yeah, that is the biggest thing is just, you have to be really clear and you can't worry about hurting people's feelings um, because it's not personal. I mean, when I tell a practice how much I want to get paid, it's not because I don't like them, you know, it's because this is what I think I need to get paid in order to um, cover this amount of time for you. And luckily I've never had anybody react badly. Um, I've had some people say, yeah, we hear you, but we're not, that's more than what we're willing to deal with. Um, that's, that's fine.